Hello everyone. This is uh, a demo video for one of the new features added in Testing Wish 4.0. Now, the new feature which we are talking about is integration of test management tools with Testing Wish. In general, test management tools provide users to store and classify the tests along with the results. Also, it helps to coordinate the efforts of testers right at one place. You can store all your test cases, test scripts, bugs and test supporting materials at one place, which can be accessible to all the users. Now the question is, how does that help testing with users? TestingWiz has been closely integrated Quality Center and its API. TestingWiz supports integration with Quality Center right out of the box, which allows users to upload their test cases, test steps, test scripts, and log a bug in QC with a simple user interface. To achieve this, we have to uh, configure a minimal settings through this configuration window by going into quality center part and then setting our profile with some four, four uh, minimal settings after this settings have been uh, entered successfully click on ok and then test connection if the connection is successful then it shows connected successfully then press ok and then ok now, uh, TestingWiz uh, can upload your test scripts and test uh, steps, test cases along with test cases only when it is only when the test project which is to be uploaded is executed once. Now, so in order to achieve that thing, we have to uh, run this test case at least once. So here we execute this test script. It will open a browser, Firefox browser, and will execute the test cases. Now this test case has been intentionally uh, made to fail because there's a option to log a bug in QC via testing this. So we can demonstrate along this along with our QC integration. So to open the test management tool window we have to click on this icon and then a small window gets opened. Now currently we are supporting only Quality Center as a part of test management tool support. From here you can choose tool type and from here you can choose user profiles which have been uh, set, set in the configurations window. To use that profile we, we need to connect here. After connection successfully we have to select a domain, a project, which is where to be uh, uploaded the test cases. Now we can select the test plan directory from here. Select we can select one of these, or we can create our own testing folder. So I'm going to create this testing folder in order to demonstrate that. Similarly, we can also choose test lab directory from here. Now, the option we were talking about to submit a defect is lies here. If we click this checkbox, the, the defect will get submitted. And if we don't, then it will not get submitted. So we are clicking this submit but submit defect checkbox and then submitting it.
now the window disappears and the project is get submitted to QC now let's check that in, in into QC we, we need to refresh this test plan lab see here uh, test testing folder is created and then we need we get to see this attachment file this attachment file consists of our uh, project file which we have created and then in this we, we can see our test case test this test steps which which were in our test project now if you see test lab then we need we will see this we need to refresh it once again we can see here the test cases which have been included in our test project this is the single test cases which we have uh, uploaded here and the status is failed now in the defects window we can see our defect log this is the defect 12th number defect information so here we conclude our demo of the new feature added into testing with that is QC, uh, quality center integration with testing with thanks for watching